Hi everyone, it's Dawn and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, I'm Dawn. I'm a 52 year old woman here in the mature beauty community and I do anti-aging beauty, skincare reviews, product reviews, um, diet, um, menopause talk, you name it, we talk about it. And I really like to do handbag reviews and unboxings because handbags are a passion of mine as well. So I have a handbag for you today that just got here and I did cheat and open the box and take the extra wrapping off the bag because whenever I unbox a bag for you, I find that I end up unwrapping it all and then editing out the part where I'm taking all the wrapping off the bag because you're not here to see that. You just want to see the bag, right? So today's bag is from Rebecca Minkoff and I review a lot of Rebecca Minkoff bags because I love her bags. I find that the quality is amazing. When I want to resell them, I get a good amount of money back in return. So they're good for resale. Um, they often are inspired by high-end bags, particularly like YSL and um, bags like that. I wouldn't say they're dupes because it's not like when you go to Amazon and you purchase a dupe bag and then you get it and it looks like the high-end bag, but cheap. You know, the stitching is coming out or it comes out easily or the leather isn't up to par, that kind of thing. You're gonna get every bit of the quality with Rebecca Minkoff that you'll get with a high-end bag, but you're not getting the YSL name nor the price tag. So I really like Rebecca Minkoff a lot. And there was a bag that I had my eye on. I watched a movie and in the movie there was a, if you blinked, you'd miss it, but the girl in the movie was carrying this adorable clutch. and. I noticed things like that. And I was like, oh, where'd she get that clutch? I wonder where that bag came from. And there is like a website you can go to called Worn on TV. And sometimes if you put in like a series or a movie, they'll tell you where they got their clothes. It's not always up to date and they don't show everything, but I looked and the girl had a YSL bag. So I was like, oh, that's so cute. I've never been a clutch carrier and I've never wanted a clutch really, except for nights when I'm going out with my husband and it's just the two of us or going to a wedding, you know, that kind of thing, or a night out with the girls. I like to have a clutch, but I'm older now and I don't have little kids anymore. So I thought a clutch could be a very handy bag to have. And this bag is called a ruched clutch or a dumpling clutch. They're shaped like a little dumpling. And if you look on the internet, I can name several brands right off the top of my head. Well, obviously YSL makes them and Monsieur Gavial, I'm not sure how you pronounce it, another very high-end brand. And then you've got your mid-range, Hobo Original makes one and Topshop makes one. And that's a very affordable brand at Nordstrom. I think they might sell it other places too. And then Rebecca Minkoff makes one. So those are five right off the top of my head. And so I looked at all the bags. I ruled out the YSL and I ruled out the Monsieur Gabriel. I'm not sure how you say his name. I'm so sorry. Because the YSL is like $1,800 and then the Monsieur whatever is like $700. And I'm not going to pay that much for a clutch. It's just a cute little bag I want to add to my collection for the look of the bag and the ease of carrying a clutch, but it's not going to be an everyday bag where I could justify spending that much. So then I looked at the other brands and Hobo Original made a really, really cute one, but it only comes in three colors, black, red, and then a metallic. And I wanted mine to be tan. And then I looked at Topshop and they made a really cute one. But Topshop, I love Topshop bags, but sometimes they can look a little cheapy. And so then I went to Rebecca Minkoff and I had a 30% off coupon because I shop there and they text me when they have specials. So pretty often I get 30% off. So sign up for their tax if you ever purchase anything there and they'll send you very frequently 30% off tax and that's when I shop. So they had the color I wanted and they had the dumpling bag. It's called a ruched clutch and I'm so excited because I pulled it out of the box and I love it. So let's just go over this. This is what it looks like. It's ruched. It looks like a dumpling and it's the perfect shade of tan. 
the only other more perfect shade would have been more like dune like a little bit darker but i'm so happy with this for spring and summer i think i will wear the heck out of this and i don't know if the ysl bag and i know the monsieur gabriel does not have this cute little tassel detail and so it got a little bent in shipping and that happens with tassels so what i do is i flatten them out put like a book on them and lay them on the kitchen table for a while and then when i take the book off it's all nice and straight and so th that's never an issue but that's really cute and i was really happy that this is here because it also has a hook here so i can go on to either um, etsy or a website called pimp your bag where they sell accessories for your bags and i can get like a little chain um wristlet so i can turn it into a wristlet if i want it to be um, it doesn't have any way to attach a strap this way to make it a cross body, which would be so cute. Um, there isn't another like hook or anything. Uh, that's unfortunate. Too bad they didn't put like a little something there, but that's okay. I didn't buy it for a cross body. I have several of those. I really just wanted the clutch. And I like the idea that I can have it hang from my wrist if I want it to. Now I'm gonna show you how this cute little dumpling bag opens. And I think I said already, mine's in cool tan. And before I open it, it's 11 inches across, seven inches from bottom to top, and then four inches in depth. So it's a pretty spacious clutch. It's got a zipper and it's very smooth. And that's another thing with Rebecca Minkoff, you're gonna get the quality that you're looking for in a high-end bag. You're gonna have smooth zippers that don't tarnish. All the stitching is going to be perfect. Um, the lining is going to be nice. And if you don't like it, you can return it. If you get them at Nordstrom, return policy, easy peasy, Bloomingdale's, the Rebecca Minkoff website, very easy. So that's what it looks like. I unzipped it and then it opens like this big flat like circle. I actually saw a video of someone um, on like, not this bag, but the YSL and they had it like this and just showed everything that fits. It is very spacious, a lot fits in it, and I can do a what's in my handbag for you if you'd like. Um, so it's, you put all your stuff in, close it up, and then obviously zip it again. But it also has this interior pocket that's fairly deep. I can get my whole hand in it. You know, I, like I said, it's like seven inches, so it's about the whole height of my hand so you can put a lot of your little essentials that you don't want rolling about in here and you have room for your wallet and a little cosmetics couch couch a little cosmetics pouch a comb a brush you know um whatever you need it's a fairly spacious clutch so i'm gonna zip it closed very easy zipper i like dumpling clutch better than ruched clutch it's called the ruched clutch clutch though i think they also have it in several other colors on the rebecca minkoff website so check it out i'm not sure what what all is still available now but i know cool tan is and yeah so this is the whole thing and i hope you enjoyed my little review and unboxing of my rebecca minkoff ruched clutch or dumpling clutch i think i'm gonna really enjoy toting this little guy around on spring break this year or entering the summer with a light little sundress. It's going to be so cute. And leave me any questions or comments below and I'll see you next time. Have a blessed and beautiful day. Thank you for spending some time with me.